Welcome to another SOLIDWORKS feature in three minutes. Today we are looking at the convert to sheet metal feature. So we do a very quick, simple version of this. We're going to start off on sketching on our top plane as usual. Center rectangle and we'll call it 150 millimeters by 150 millimeters. Close our sketch, we go to feature and we'd extrude and we will say direction one and we bring it up 100 millimeters. And just for talk's sake, plain carbon steel. Now we have a 150 millimeter square by 100 millimeter high box. Next thing we want, sheet metal. Convert to sheet metal. We want to select the bottom of our box, click. All our parameters are here. So we're saying we're using this face as the bottom of our box. Two millimeters for sheet thickness. 3 millimeters for our bend radius. Then we have bend edges, rip edges found, rip sketches, corner details, custom bends. We go to our bend edges. So this is our base face, the bottom of our box. If we click as you go over the line and it highlights, click. Now there's one side on our box. So we have four sides, two, three, four. Now we have four sides on our box. I'm not going to put in the lid. Down here we have a welder's gap. So you can see there is our preview. So if we drop our gap to 0.5 and we add in, we have our K factor and we also have an auto relief. But actually if we bring this down lower we say 0.1 and we click go. We now have a sheet metal version of the same box. So you can do inside outside measurements. You can keep the original box, which is in keep body. Reverse the thickness for inside and outside. Flat pattern. And there's our flat pattern if you wanted to cut the same box. Isometric. And that is our box. This was another SOLIDWORKS feature in three minutes. Please like and subscribe. There's more content on my channel. Till the next time.